Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you guys how to make a delicious chicken tortilla soup. So in case you guys want to know how to make this super easy and delicious recipe, just stay tuned and I'll show you how. Alrighty guys, so let's get started with our ingredients. So for this recipe we're going to need 20 tortillas, 4 pieces of chicken breast, 1 small white onion, 4 garlic cloves, 5 Roma tomatoes, 1 small bunch of cilantro, 4 California, New Mexico or Guajillo chili pots, 1 large can of corn, vegetable oil, chicken bouillon, 1 teaspoon of cumin, and black pepper. For our toppings, we're going to need queso fresco, your choice of shredded cheese, sour cream, limes, chile serranos, and avocados. So these are ingredients, now let's get started. Alright guys, so first we're going to start by cutting one fourth of our white onion. One fourth is going to be used for our sauce and the other we're going to put it with our chicken. Okay. Alright guys, so in a large pot we're going to place our chicken and I already washed and cleaned my chicken. So we're just going to place it in a pot. Along with our onion, two garlic cloves, and our bunch of cilantro. We're going to season it with three tablespoons of chicken bouillon. And black pepper. And to our pot we're going to add 13 cups of water. Alright guys, and I'm going to set my stove on high heat and let that cook for 25 minutes. Alright guys, so while we wait for our chicken, we can start working on our tortilla strips. So we're going to cut them into strips. Alright guys, so just cut your tortilla strips like this. Okay? Alright guys, so once we cut our tortillas into strips, we are ready to make them into chips. So in a large frying pan, I'm going to set it on medium high heat. I'm going to add some oil. Alright guys, so once our oil is hot, we're going to throw in our tortilla strips. Make sure you separate them. And we're gonna cook them until they turn into a beautiful golden color. Just like if you're making chips. All right, guys, so once your tortilla chips look like this, place them on a paper towel so like that we can uh, remove the excess oil. And just continue working on them until you're done with all your tortillas. All right, guys, so after the 25 minutes, we're going to remove our chicken breast and we're just going to allow it to cool down so like that we can shred it. All right, guys, so once our chicken is ready, we are ready to start working on our tomato base. So for our chiles, we're going to remove the stem and we're also going to depot them. So take out the seeds. Okay, just like that. And I already washed them. So make sure you wash your tomatoes and your chiles. All right, so once we have depot our chiles, we are ready to put them in a pot. Okay, so put them in the pot with enough water to cover the tomatoes and our chiles. All right, so just put it on your stove and set it on high heat. So we're just going to bring it to a boil, and then once our tomatoes are done, we're going to remove them from the heat. All right, so while we wait for our tomatoes and our chiles to come to a boil, we can start shredding our chicken. All right guys, so once we have our chicken all nicely shredded, we're going to set it to the side. And we're going to remove the cilantro, onion, and garlic cloves from our broth. We already got all of its we already got all of its flavor on the broth, so we no longer need it. Okay, so that we have our broth, and this is what we're going to be using to blend our tomatoes and chiles together. Okay, right, so in our blender, we're going to add our tomatoes. Our chiles. We're going to add our two garlic cloves, our one fourth of an onion, one teaspoon of cumin, 
two tablespoons of chicken bouillon. And we're gonna fill up our cup with our broth. And it's up to you guys if you want to strain your broth. All right, so once we have everything in our blender, we are ready to make our sauce. All right, so you're going to want to strain the remaining broth just because we're not going to be able to um, blend with the rest of our ingredients. All right, so now we're going to blend everything until we have a very smooth broth. All right, so once everything's smooth, we are ready to transfer it back into our pot. All right, so I added the remaining broth in my pot, and now I'm going to set it on medium-high heat. And now we're going to pour our tomato broth. So now we're just going to wait for that to come to a boil and then we can move on to the next step. All right guys, so once your broth begins to simmer, we're going to add our chicken. along with our corn. And I drain the water out of the corn. And now we're just going to add it. We're going to mix that. We're going to mix it together. And now you want to try it for salt. For me, this is perfect, so I'm not going to add anything else. Um, so now we're just going to let that simmer for five to 10 minutes. And then we basically have our tortilla soup. You can always add your tortilla chips in here. For me personally, I like to add them last just because I like to uh, have the crunchiness from the tortilla. So now we're just going to wait and then that's basically all. All right guys, so once our soup is ready, we're going to turn it off and now we are ready to serve. So I placed some tortilla chips on my bottom of my bowl. All right like that. Now let's go put it together. So I'm going to start by placing my cheese on top of my soup. We're going to add more tortilla chips. I'm going to add some queso fresco. Some sour cream. Some slices of avocado. Some chile serrano. And I'm gonna squeeze out some lime juice. And now we are ready to enjoy our delicious chicken tortilla soup. All right, you guys, and now for the best part, the taste test. Going to mix it all together. Seriously, super delicious. Everything on the soup is perfect. Alrighty guys, and there you have it. I how to make a super easy and delicious chicken tortilla soup. I hope you guys had enjoyed watching this video. And if you did, please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Share it with your friends and family. And if you recreate this recipe, please don't forget to tag me on any of my social medias. And if you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button so you guys can be part of our family. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye. Oh yeah, yeah. Eres perfecta mujer, de la cabeza a los pies, tú pasas de mi nivel, tú tienes el piquete, de la forma que tú besas mami, más simétrica que un origami, de la forma
forma que tú besas, mami Más simétrica que un origami 